Barney's is, is, is my favorite spot. I mean, that, that place is, I've spent a lot of time there. Spent a lot of money there too, but uh, I'm a big, big fashion guy. I love clothes. I got a lot of respect for uh, the fashion game and uh, shoes. I love shoes, suits, um, and then just the street. The street clothing lines, I mean, it's, uh, it's awesome. And uh, the S Supreme is, is, is huge too. I, I'm sure you know what Supreme is, but uh, it's, uh, that's like the biggest company in the world in my eyes for, for fashion. And you can turn a $2 t-shirt into a thousand dollar t-shirt just, just based off of the brand. Um, so seeing the lineups and stuff outside of Supreme is, is pretty cool to see as well. El Molino, like I touched on for, for eating is, is, is fantastic. Just my dad's favorite restaurant there and the food's great. I, I eat, I'm a celiac, so I eat gluten-free and any Italian spot that can make gluten-free pasta and make it taste good with, with a nice meat sauce is, it's in my good books, that's for sure. On a typical weekend in New York City, where would you find me? It totally depends. If it's the off season, um, on a Saturday night, Brad Peltz would probably have me somewhere out um, in the city of New York. If it's during the season, uh, probably out at dinner somewhere with the boys. Where am I taking my friends when they come to visit me in New York? Well, I'm usually the one visiting them in New York, but um, when I am in New York, um, probably take them to Barney's first and Flight Club, the shoe store. Uh, go look at some Jordans and some Nikes, hang out there for a bit and then uh, just go buzz around the city. Maybe go over and, and look at the Statue of Liberty, Battery Park there, or walk through Central Park. I mean, the list goes on. You can't do everything in New York, so no matter what's going on, there's always gonna be something else you can be doing. For an expensive meal, I would take someone to Nobu. Great atmosphere, uh, good food, big sushi guy too, so uh, Nobu. Um, what do I love most about New York City? I think it's just uh, the energy within the city. I mean, you, some people aren't built for, for, for that kind of um, craziness, I guess you can call it, but it brings out some type of energy in everyone. I mean, you go there, whether it's, I mean, the stress just elevates or, or something, but it's always just like, oh, like, wow, this is cool. And uh, the traffic, the, the sounds, um, I mean, just all the lights, go to Times Square, like just all the different people. You'll meet so many cool people and uh, that city just got so much opportunity. So um, I think it's a, it's a great place. My biggest hidden gem in New York City is Silver Lining, which is a sunglass store. Um, the boys there, uh, Rasta and Johnny V will take care of you. Best service and some of the most rare, never seen before sunglasses. But uh, if they can get my old man to wear some aviators that uh, are circular aviators, then they can get you to wear whatever, whatever you want. So um, go check them out, they're awesome.